Welcome to downtown Largo, Florida, where we have our brick and mortar store where we buy, sell, trade, coins, gold, watches, jewelry, practically everything of value. And we're here to answer some questions today and give you a lot of information. Is my Waterford crystal worth anything? Uh, it's kind of a loaded question. Absolutely. Waterford's a very high quality Irish crystal and it does have value. It still costs a lot new. The only thing I can tell you though is there is a there is a contingent that they are selling it on some of these shopping networks on the television. And anytime a big company like that that has kind of like a high-end appeal starts mass selling something on a home shopping network, it kind of two-way street for them. They get the benefit of selling a lot more product, but it diminishes that kind of that status level that Waterfords had. So the secondary market on your Waterford Crystal is extremely down right now because people can buy new on these home shopping networks, I mean, for much, much less and in greater quality, quantity. So what that means is your crystal pattern type items, there's like Lismore, there's certain items that, you know, they have a name to each pattern. Those are still doing okay because we still have a lot, big customer base looking for, I need a Lismore goblet. I need, uh, you know, something else in a certain style. They like that. But when it comes to the crystal vases, candlesticks, bowls, ashtrays, candy dishes, those are extremely down in price. And I can relate to you a story that happened to me the, the other day. I was in my store and a customer came over because we buy and sell crystal china. And she had gone to my crystal department and she had a big bag of Waterford and she was selling me her gold diamond jewelry. And I'm like, hey, okay. I said, well, what's that? She says, well, that's my Waterford. I said, well, why didn't we buy it? She says, oh, they're not dealing in that anymore right now. And I said, oh my gosh. I ran over to my crystal department. I'm like getting ready to chew their heads off. And I said, what's going on here? She says, look. So we went online. We took a look at what's going on. And these items were selling so inexpensively online that they were right. Vase, a vase that was selling for 2000 new was selling for 200 online. So what it is, is they just didn't want to offer the person, hey, guess what, your 2000 vase is, we can only offer you 100, because if we're gonna sell it for 200, we gotta make a profit, just on crystal in China. Coins aren't that way. But crystal porcelain, it's a double or triple markup, because it sits in your store forever. You have to pay somebody to clean it. You have to sell it, pay a staff. You have to advertise for it. So basically, I would say right now, Waterford's still a very high quality brand but it is definitely kind of slow moving on the second, secondary market. I hope this helped. Thanks for tuning in. If you like what you saw, please press the like button and also subscribe to my channel. I like to keep doing videos and there'll be more to come. If you have any additional questions, feel free to email, text or call. Thank you very much.